Huh? All right, so looking at here, I have a cosine of t times 1 plus tangent of t, uh, tangent squared of t. One thing you guys can look at is to multiply, right? But even before multiplying, I could say this, well, what can I write with my 1 plus tangent squared of, you know, t, right? I can transform this. Maybe that might make it simpler. So I go ahead and look at my trig identity. And my trig identity is going to tell me that 1 plus tangent equals secant. And obviously we're using t, not x. So these are squares. So therefore, why not I just rewrite that as secant squared? So I'll be left with cosine of t times secant squared of t. Right? Yeah. Thank you. So now we have cosine t, right, times secant um, squared of t. Well, we can write this as cosine t times 1 over cosine squared of t. Right? Yeah? No? Yeah. Okay, good. What other way? Yeah, and you could, well, yeah, you could also write that as 1 over secant. And that's that's another way I think I actually showed last time. Um, and then well, what you notice is then that will cancel out, and that will cancel out. And you're just left with 1 over cosine of t, which equals secant of t. And yes, if you just wanted to write this as 1 over secant and then cancel them out, that would work as well. Okay. So...